In North Texas and around the nation, really, COVID-19 has disproportionately impacted minority communities. And now, a massive new local study, a joint effort between UT Southwestern and Texas Health Resources, looks to determine why. Our Robbie Owens reports. The numbers are daunting. Today, more than 48,000 confirmed infections in Dallas and Tarrant counties, and those are just the ones being tested. These cases only represent the tip of the iceberg, and the true prevalence of COVID-19 is likely underestimated. UT Southwestern and Texas Health researchers say identifying asymptomatic patients of COVID-19 is critical, especially in minority communities where the spread of the disease is exponentially higher. We believe um, that these disparities extend beyond any biological differences and could be related, if not likely related, um, to differences in environmental and behavioral factors, um, such as crowded living situations. Some 30,000 volunteers in Dallas and Tarrant counties will be invited to participate in the study with a deliberate focus on screening across racial and economic lines. Already, investigators are pleading for the cooperation needed to provide answers. Science is continually evolving in terms of our understanding of the COVID pandemic, and we're all working really hard to advance the science. The goal is to have study participants identified within the next five months, leading me to ask experts today whether they believe COVID-19 will still be ravaging our communities well into next year. I don't think anyone can predict with any precision uh, how long uh, this will be present in the community, but it's something that we have to prepare for. And knowledge about epidemiology, uh, behaviors, and uh, specific policy changes we may be able to make. Uh, we feel that the, the study will generate in information along those lines. Robbie Owens, CBS 11 News.